morning everyone it is bright outside today is friday and i'm just getting back in my car i have left hobby lobby i got some things for the project in my room that i'm doing my reading corner and yeah picked up some things from here picked up some things from dollar tree because i like the saying balling on a budget so i like to make my house look nice not having to spend a whole lot of money found good deals here at hobby lobby and yeah now i'm about to go pay my mortgage and i'm going to go to walmart so just running errands it's cold outside but it's warm right now because I just got in the car and it's a little warm in here. So anyway, you guys, um, yeah, I'm so excited about my project in my room. Let's get to Walmart. Um, first, I'm going to, I can actually pay my mortgage online. So I think I may do that instead of having to go inside the bank. So I'll do that when I get home and then I will, I'm gonna go to Walmart right now. Okay, so I am back home. I went to Winco. I went to the Dollar Tree, went to Hobby Lobby. Um, I paid my mortgage online, so I didn't have to go into the bank. Um, what else did I do? I said Walmart, yeah. And so I'm painting right now. I'm actually letting the first coat dry. And yes, like I said, you guys will all see that when everything is done. But I am just here relaxing. I'm actually watching DIYs on YouTube. So yeah, you guys, I'm excited. That's all I'm doing right now. Whole lot of nothing and whole lot of nothing so I am cooking okra for dinner and of course with okra because it's really slimy you have to fry it until all the slime is out so that's what I'm doing now until it cooks down and there's no more slime so yeah so this is the okra you guys this is for Cheyenne and I and this right here this is Savannah's, and I'm using a different spoon because hers is vegan, so it's just the okra without any of the meat. decided to come to San Francisco to the beach just to get away and it's just me and Savannah today we are at Ocean Beach it's really nice out here the weather is cold but it's pretty nice you guys isn't this beautiful you would think I'd be at the beach more than I normally am but I'm not I like this lighting wall in Savannah's camera she has a camera right there and she's taking pictures. The guy over there is about to go surfing. And Savannah just took a bunch of pictures. <gasps> oh, I like that. I kind of look cute. <laughs> Take the double chin out. <laughs> so the guys are out there surfing. The guys, like I know them. The boys. The boys. And Savannah thought they were cute. <laughs> Isn't it crazy? It's been about four days since I last showed you guys it. And I think the other stem was down here somewhere. And now it went past the other flowers. So yeah, and I'm actually just turning it around because it leans toward the light. So actually, maybe Savannah turned it around already that way. It'll See how it's like this? I'm pretty sure in a couple hours it'll be leaning this way. So I will leave it like this. She probably did turn it around. So I shouldn't touch it because y'all know. Good morning, everyone. Today is Thursday. 
um, I'm at my computer. I, yesterday was my first day working from home. It went well, I mean, the same work that I was doing just at home. I have to get used to only having one screen because for now I'm using my laptop, but they are ordering me their own computer, their own computer, my own computer that I can have here, which is gonna be great and everything. So I just, over the weekend, I got onto the company's, is it VPN? That's how I'm able to use my own computer, you know, for things that we normally do at the job. So yeah, oh, and I start at eight, right? What time is it? 7.40, so I have time to talk to you guys. Anyway, um, if you hear that, that's my dishwasher running in the background. I got up a little bit early to wash the dishes and the reason why I'm like dressed from the waist up at least is because we're going to have like a zoom conference later on this morning and I just wanted to make sure I'm ready other than that I mean I'd still be in my bonnet and my pajamas um, even though I'm in my pajamas from the waist down um, what was I gonna tell you guys oh so remember I showed you guys maybe like three weeks ago or in the last couple of vlogs that they were doing like construction or the city is doing some kind of work on the sidewalk or the road outside it stopped right and i thought they were done they hadn't been here in maybe like two and a half three weeks maybe it's been a while the minute i clocked in all of a sudden i heard that drill on the street i guess that jackhammer whatever they do to bust up the concrete eight o'clock right when i started I mean, I know they have to do what they have to do, but it's like, are you serious right now? So, yeah, this is nice, you guys. I mean, it's still work, so I'm still gonna have to do my job that I've been doing, but it's just at home, which is awesome. And it's cool because on my breaks, I can start dinner or anything like that that I need to. So yeah, you guys, this is going to be nice. Deleted some work messages. I didn't do yesterday. I already get messages from my manager. You know what? Let me get off the computer because it is not eight o'clock yet. Look, you guys, I'm so sad. So my seat covers here. This one belongs on there. I was painting something on my countertop because I have the most space here. And normally when I do paint, I move the chairs back. Well, this time I thought, oh, it's not going to be messy. Yeah, I should have listened to my first thought because paint splattered and no matter what I did, I used bleach, I used the Tide pin, I took it off like immediately. I used everything known to man to try to get this off and it will not come out. So now the thing is, do I want to spend $10 to buy another one or leave this on there? But I'm not very happy with this. This is going to bug me. It's clean, but it looks dirty because of these four spots yeah but I'm gonna put it back on now okay nope uh-uh if it was a tiny little dot I could have dealt with it but this is going to bug me tremendously so I guess I will be going to Ikea probably not today but to pick up another one because that's not okay but if you guys do know a trick to get paint stains <laughs> out of fabric or just paint stains out period let me know because nothing I did worked. I know I didn't vlog a whole lot today, but I'm extremely tired. I am actually going to go to bed. What time is it? It always feels later than what it is. It's 926. I'm tired, like I said, but I wanted to come on and tell you guys. Savannah and I went to Walmart after she got off work and went to Winco also. So I was at the self-checkout and we heard this commotion like right in front and you could see everything that's clearly going on. I couldn't hear everything, but I heard them call security. So I'm like, oh my goodness, you know, let's get our stuff and hurry and get out of here. But they were blocking the door. So I was just kind of like taking my time, but trying to hurry up if that makes any sense to check out the few little things that I had. But I guess a guy came in the store, he didn't have his mask on and they were telling him, oh, sir, you know, you have to have your mask to enter the store. And he was going on and on about, oh, it's not a law. I hate when people try to use that excuse. No, it's not a law, but it's an ordinance. It's the way that our life is right now. And if we ever want to get out of this, that's what we need to do. So he tried to give them trouble and tried to come in the store anyway. And they had like 
five of the Winco workers and the security guard and they were like no you're not coming in here so he didn't come in so I was happy I and people were clapping and I'm like yeah I'm so glad they stood their ground but people they'll put it on to go in that they'll take it off in the middle of the store so yeah I was glad that they stood their ground and they were like you're not coming in without your mask it's just a mask wear it I mean, none of us want to do this. Do you think I want to go around wearing a mask all day when you're out in public? No. Who wants to do that? But that's what we have to do until we get rid of this thing. So, yeah. Anyway, I'm tired. I'm going to bed. Look at this plant, you guys. I think it's so beautiful. And see some of the flowers that were bloomed are dead or dying but look at this and then wait where is it oh, it bloomed so there was one yesterday that was just hadn't bloomed yet and it bloomed already and I'm guessing because this one is the smallest one that that's the one that was completely closed last night I should have set my camera up so I can do a time lapse and see because I swear to you guys this plant grows overnight it grows by the second and it's just crazy so today's friday by the way i don't know if i said that before i showed you guys the flower but all the fall decoration that i had out is now about to come down because we are going to put the tree up tonight oh and i got my christmas card from my sister girl margaret hey maggie hey girl thank you anyway i'm gonna take this down um that way it can be ready for later I just don't have a bin to put it in great and I'm going to take this down because even though it's cute and all it's no longer fall and I'm tired of seeing it <laughs> okay so the table in my nook is cleaned off and I'm just gonna put my Ray Dunn stuff back on here because I don't have any holiday decor that I put on here I may or may not get some but Everything is off these two tables and I already dusted it and I'm just going to leave it as is. I know I'm going to put holiday stuff up, the candle that I was using, and I'm not going to put that away, of course, because I still use it. And even though it's orange, it still smells really good and it goes with my living room. So I will keep that out. Don't judge me. But because I forgot to get a bin, all of the fall decoration is in this bag and this bag right here. So I'm just going to put these away until... I go to the store to get another bin and that way I can put them neatly in the bin but yeah don't judge me because I have it in bags for now. It is much later. Um, I am off of work and as you can see I made the eggnog. It was wonderful to clock out, turn off the computer and just start, just be at home. And I started the eggnog and normally the kids would put up the tree and I would be making the eggnog. Well, I got off early today, not early, but I got off earlier than they did today. So the eggnog's already done, so I can participate in putting up the tree. Um, when they were younger, I would try to put up the tree at the same time making eggnog, and you can't do that because you can burn the eggnog. So I used to try to make the eggnog and then put the tree up. It was just harder when they were younger. So then when they got older, they took over putting the tree up and put the tree together and then I would make the eggnog and so now this year I made it already and I can participate in putting up the tree and the decorations so I'm excited waiting for Savannah to get off work 
and then I'm gonna start right away but you know we're gonna put stuff up I pulled things out from the garage and I have it in here so I have my lights right there because I tested everything and then there's boxes over there and I already cleared the space and I showed you guys this earlier so yeah ready to go oh and watching Leanna um, she's doing vlogmas oh so, yeah just catching up on everyone's vlogmas and waiting to put the tree up so guys let me tell you something so you know Savannah's a vegan now and there was one weekend that I ate like a vegan along with her and then there was a time where I went completely vegan for one week and no, I'm not going to tell you I'm a vegan. I'm not a vegan. But throughout that, I decided that I was going to cut out most dairy. And by most dairy, I mean like cow's milk. And so I've only had almond milk. And I really haven't had ice cream. I've had like eggs here and there or mayo or I think I had sour cream a couple of times. Um... I've had creamer in my coffee, but as far as milk, just completely almond milk. Well, today I decide that I'm going to have some ice cream. Now, mind you, it's been about a month since I've had like whole cow's milk. Because even when I have cereal, I'll have almond milk. So I decided I'm going to eat just regular ice cream today. I'm not going to go into detail. But big mistake. Big. Let your imagination go. Yeah. Yeah. That's all I'm going to say. Um, I won't be doing that again. But I love ice cream. But yeah. This feeling is not okay. He takes his food out of the bowl. And he puts it on the ground and sometimes he'll come here and eat. Which is exactly what he's doing now. Austin, you're weird. Do you guys have dogs that do that or have had dogs that has done this? And as you can see, no one's came to get the refrigerator yet. The lady, so I posted it on Facebook market for $100 or best offer, right? So if someone said, hey, 80 bucks, 70 bucks, can I have it? Yes, just come get it. I just want, I just want to get rid of it, right? It works fine, it's clean, it it's perfect. Know what she said? She said $20. I don't think so. I don't think so. 